Hi everyone, I just turned on my lab environment and I opened my studio console and it throws this error message. It says something like fail to validate the central configuration service location. Valid delivery controller services were not found at the specified location. Database could not be contacted. So it seems like uh, there is some issue with the database. It says check the status of the database on the SQL server. The database server may not be allowing remote connections okay and it also says studio has detected that the controller might not have been completely removed from a site this is expected when the controller was turned off as the removal process began if this, if it, if this is true for the current controller select complete the removal so what i'm going to do is i'm going to launch my services console So this is the services console. So it's clearly saying that there is an issue with the database. So I'm quickly going to check the services. Okay, if you see here, the SQL server agent is in stop state. I'm going to start it. Yeah, it's starting. It is going to take a few seconds. All right, seems like it is started. Let's check other Citrix related services. Okay, uh, broker service is in stop state. That is interesting. Let's start it. And if you see here, it's Citrix identity service, AD identity service. It is also in stop state. Let's start it. All right, it started. Seems like everything is good now. Let me cross check once. Okay, SQL Server agent, it went to stop state again. Let me start. Okay, it gives an error message. Let's click OK. And uh, yeah, everything looks good. Let's do one thing. Let's try to go back to studio let me try to connect to the controller and see how it goes let me connect okay yeah it's doing something Let's see how it goes. It says assessing databases. Assessing service configurations. Please bear with me while it completes this process.
Okay, it's running now. Everything looks good. So it's all it's always good to check the services whenever something is not working when you get some error message while trying to connect to studio based upon the error message you can start troubleshooting the problem so here it was clearly indicating that there was an issue with the SQL server so I had to check the services This is really taking a lot of time. Seems like something is not responding. Uh, I'm going to restart Citrix configuration service. Let's see if it if it can speed up the process or not. Okay, it says assessing configuration files now. Okay, this is getting restarted.
Okay. All right. I see some error message now. There was a problem communicating with the server. Let me click on view details. What does it say? Uh, the HTTP server located at so and so location is unavailable. This could be because the service is too busy or because no endpoint was found listening at the specified address. Please ensure that the address is correct and trying to and try accessing accessing the service again later. Okay. All right, let me close it. Let me close this one as well. And let me try to connect again and see how it goes. Yeah, everything looks good actually. Uh, SQL Server Agent is going down. It's getting stopped. Let's see how it goes. Something is not responding. Uh, I'll do one thing. I'll try to restart. I'll try to restart SQL Server. Okay, I'm going to restart. It's a lab environment, so you shouldn't create any problems. Okay, so it's been restarted. Okay, it says you're not authorized to perform this operation. Very interesting. I do have permissions. There was a problem communicating with the Citrix a delegated administration service. If you see here, it clearly indicates that there was a problem communicating with the Citrix a delegated administration service. Let's quickly go to services and see the status of Citrix Delegated Administration Service. Okay, here it is. It's Citrix Delegated Administration Service. It's in a running state. It's already started. For whatever reason, it's throwing this error message that there was a problem communicating with the service, Citrix Delegated Administration Service. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly restart this service and see how it goes. All right, it's almost there.
So once this is restarted, we can go and test again. All right, it's restarted. Let's go back to Studio Console. I'm going to close this. I'm going to close this and try to connect to the controller and see how it goes. OK, it is assessing databases, assessing service configurations. Seems like it is moving fast this time. All right, loading site information. I think it's almost there. And there we go. It has launched. OK, the site has launched successfully. We could see all the details. Everything looks good. So the problem was basically uh, initially, Citrix uh, SQL Server was causing some kind of issues. SQL Server agent was causing some kind of issues, and then we started it. And then it clearly said that it it, it couldn't connect with Citrix Delegated Administration Service. So I just but the service here is in started state. If you noticed, I just restarted the service, and then we could connect successfully. Okay, uh, I hope you find this information helpful. Thank you for watching.